that going between us during COVID uh, so that we could uh, get those vegetables to the UK and also that foreign currency revenue uh, back. It's a win-win situation and that's very much the heart of our economic partnership uh, which has got a great base and we're going to continue and, and build and grow on that. Uh, and I would shamelessly say Valentine's Day is coming up, Mother's Day is coming up. Uh, I know that in the UK, something like 70% of roses uh, come from Kenya, so we have very romantic uh, connections to this country as well. Uh, and this is a shameless plug for everyone to buy everybody that they love flowers. Uh, that makes the world a happier place. Better. Thank you. Demonstration of just the impact the trade relationship we have with the United Kingdom that was recently concluded and cemented in an economic partnership agreement could provide an opportunity for us to expand exports from Kenya into the United Kingdom uh, and especially for farmers. Uh, we're happy the governor uh, is here with us because uh, a lot of the farmers that supply these products are from his uh, county. And there's an opportunity for more farmers uh, to join in and take advantage of this uh, certain uh, market. We export nearly 40 billion uh, shillings worth of goods to the United Kingdom each year. And it's actually uh, last year we even exported more despite, despite COVID. So the message for us is that this uh, policy uh, of the national government and the trade agreements actually have real impact uh, on the ground and we're just very happy to be able to witness it uh, in operation right here in Flamingo and in, uh, in Mary, as I understand it.